In this tech tip, I explain how to create a raised logo or text onto a non-cylindrical surface. In this example, the cover cap of a rim. If you take a closer look at the sketch of the cover cap, you see that it was created with a spline and is therefore not cylindrical. You can already prepare the logo in another part studio and insert it using the derive feature or you can start on any plane with a sketch. The distance to the surface is not important at first, but the position and orientation is. To define the height of the raised logo later, you must first create a surface. You can use the offset surface feature to do this. Using a variable, you can easily control the height later. Then, create an extrude and select the previously created surface as the boundary of the extrusion. This defines the height of the logo. Now activate the second end position option, select up to face again, and now select the surface from which the logo should start. In this case, the surface of the cover cap. Make sure that the extrusion directions are correct and you have projected and extruded your logo and text onto a non-cylindrical surface. If you change the variable with the final button activated, you have an optimal preview if you want to adjust the height of the logo. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more on shape tech tips.